they target gun-free zones, and they that's a fact, and they and or target places where the likelihood of having a firearm is going to be low. So even at these schools that have school resource officers, if it's just one, that's laughable. That's laughable. You know how I many folks can be killed in a minute? That's laughable. And you can't tell me you ain't got the money. They go up on the damn taxes every year. I want more school resource officers in the school. And I don't want the officers that were retired on duty and the rejects. I want the top guy who knows how to use his mouthpiece first, knows how to recognize that this child may be dealing with something. Not to call him out and make him feel bad, to help the child. First, we have to understand that mental health, when you're having mental health issues, that's your body trying to tell you that it's too much. Depression and anxiety, you should welcome if that stuff is coming. So it's telling you something's wrong. I need to make some changes. So I want us to get out of the looking at mental health as such a negative thing. And it's actually something that we're going to start talking a lot more about because I personally have been dealing with mental health issues and overcoming this stuff. And, and if anything, I want to give people the game. And I want to share what I've been through so that, number one, people can see that they're not alone. You don't have to feel that way. And two, because you're dealing with depression and anxiety, that's a good thing because it's there to tell you that it's too much. And you need to look at what's going on inside and figure out where are the drama and stress is coming from. With me, most of it was self induced all childhood stuff and self-induced. You know, we're all dealing with a lot. 